Hey everyone, welcome back to effect for you channel. Today, we are going to create, clean corporate slideshow, like this. So let's get started. First create a new comp, I call this main comp. Now create one more composition. I call this BG1 comp. Drag your image into the timer line. And resize according to the comp. Go to first frame and add a keyframe on scale. Then go to 5 to 6 seconds forward and increase scale amount 5%. Perfect. Now go to main comp and drag BG1 comp into the timer line. And apply tint effect. Now create a white solid layer. Opacity around 80%. Now select shape tool and create a shape like this. And apply fill effect. Change fill color as you like. And opacity around 90%. Change the rotation like this. Now we need to animate the position. So go to around 2 seconds forward. And add a keyframe on position. Then go to first frame and move the shape left side of the composition. Select both keyframe and easy ease them. And make your graph like this. Now duplicate the layer. Change rotation amount. And move the first keyframe right side of the comp. Perfect. Again create a shape like this. And apply the same fill effect. Change opacity around 50%. Now open rectangle transform. And change skew minus 30. Now animate the position, so go to around 2 second forward and add a keyframe. Then go to first frame, and move the shape layer bottom side of the composition. Select both keyframes and easy ease them, and make your graph like this. Adjust the keyframes according to you. I think we can change the color a little bit lighter. Perfect. Now duplicate the layer. Delete both keyframes. And adjust the shape. Now animate the position. So go to around 2 second forward and add a keyframe on position. Then go to first frame and move your shape right side of the comp. Select both keyframes and easy ease them. And make your graph like this.
Now drag plexus footage into the timer line, and change layer mode screen, and also change opacity 30%. Here you can see Now create a new composition 1100 by 1500 pixels This is our placeholder 1 comp Drag your image into the timer line Now go to main comp and drag placeholder 1 comp into the timer line Resize according to the comp Now go to around 2 seconds forward and add a keyframe on position. Then go to first frame and change the position, bottom side of the comp. Select both keyframes and easy ease them, and make your graph like this. Perfect. Now search drop shadow effect. Direction 180 degree. Distance 0. Softness 80. And opacity 25%. Now duplicate the placeholder. Increase the size 5% and delete both keyframes then select rectangle tool and create a mask like this rotate the mask and add a keyframe on mask path and move the mask top side of the comp then go to first frame and move the mask bottom side of the comp Also move the layer few frame forward. Perfect. Now create a new composition. 250 by 80 pixels. This is our element 1 comp. Now select Bend tool and create a triangle shape like this. Move anchor point left side of the shape. Now open scale and unlink the scale amount, change Y scale amount 50% and X scale amount 0%, and add a keyframe, then go to around 15 frames forward, and change amount 100%, then again go to 15 frame forward, and change Y scale amount 100%. Select all keyframes and easy ease them, and make your graph like this. Perfect. Now go to first frame and add a keyframe on opacity, then go to 10 frame forward and add a keyframe. Now go to few frame forward and change opacity 0%. Then again go to 10 to 15 frames forward, and change opacity 100%. You can adjust the keyframes. We need to apply the loop out expression on opacity.
cool. Now duplicate the layer, and move your shape. Also move the layer 2 to 3 frame forward. Similarly do the one more time. Perfect. Now go to main comp and drag element 1 comp into the timer line. And adjust them. Similarly duplicate the layer one more time and adjust them. Cool. Now again create a new comp. 100 by 100. This is our element 2 comp. Select Bend Tool and create a stroke like this. Go to 1 second forward and add a keyframe on scale. Then go to first frame and change scale amount 0%. Select both keyframes and easy ease them. And make your graph like this. Now open rotation go to second keyframe and add a keyframe on rotation. Then go to first frame and change rotation amount minus 90 degree. Select both keyframes and easy ease them, and make your graph like this. Cool. Now duplicate the layer, and change rotation, plus 90 degree. Perfect. Now go to main comp, and drag element 2 comp into the timer line. Duplicate the layer 2 to 3 time and adjust them. We also need to animate this, so open element 2. Create a null layer. Parent both layers with null layer. Now apply time expression on rotation. Cool. Now select text tool and type random number, open text layer and add character offset. Go to 6 seconds forward and add a keyframe on character offset, change offset amount 20. Then go to first frame and change character offset 0. Here you can see, now duplicate the layer and move top side of the comp. And you can also change the number. Perfect. Now create a new full HD composition. This is our main text 1 comp. Select text tool and type your text. Open text layer, go to animate, and add position, scale, and blur. Position x minus 200. Unlink scale and change x scale amount 0%. And blur 50%. Open range selector, then advanced, change shape ramp up, randomize order on, ease low 50. 
Now go to first frame and add a keyframe on offset, and change offset minus 100%, then go to 3 second forward and change offset plus 100%. Select both keyframe and easy ease them. And make your graph like this. Now go to main comp and drag main text comp into the timeline. Then apply fill effect and change fill color. Resize layer according to comp. Cool. Now create a new comp. 1000 by 600 pixel. I call this text one comp. Select text tool and create text box. And type your text. Open text layer. Go to animate, and add position, and opacity. Position Y around 70. And opacity 0%. Select animator 1, and add expression selector. Open expression selector, and change based on lines. Here I have delay expression. Copy the expression, and paste it here. Cool. Now go to main comp, and drag text 1 comp into the timeline. Resize according to the comp. Now apply fill effect, and change fill color. Perfect. Now create a new comp. 800 by 300 pixels. I call this action button comp. Select rounded rectangle tool, and create a shape like this. Increase the roundness. Now open scale, unlink scale amount and add a keyframe, and change X scale amount 0%. Then go to 2 seconds forward, and change scale amount 100%. Select both keyframes and easy ease them, and make your graph like this. Now select text tool and type your text. Go to first frame and add a keyframe on opacity, and change opacity 0%, then go to 1 second forward and change opacity 100%. Also move the layer few frame forward. Now go to main comp and drag action button comp into the timeline, and resize according to the comp. Perfect. Our animation has done. Hit zero for render. Thanks for watching. I hope you like the video. So please like it, share it, and subscribe to the channel. For more tutorial, I'll see you in the next video.